You know? Oh, okay. What do we got? Let's... Wolf Shulk? Okay. Wolf See the name Secret versus Ruse? All right, this should be one of our top 16 qualifiers from Yeah, losers, this is so. on the loser side. Ruse beating um, 9 Super Pie in the winners. But then got upset by, or I wouldn't say upset, but then lost to Red Burpo. Now this I feel like is a fair, more fairly traditional matchup. Uh, at least for our neck of the woods, right? Yeah, we, we have... A few show players, and look, there's a lot of wolves in any region. So, yeah, very popular character, and we are blessed to have a Shulk or two in our neck of the woods. So, as far as what we've come to expect, Shulk able to put down lots of uh, damage. Also able to survive decently if given the opportunity to like space themselves well. But I feel like any wolf can put out the pressure to like negate that type of option. A lot of jumping in uh, to jump art or shield art will provide opportunity for Seeker to stay alive. But yeah. We're not seeing a lot of rapid art switching here. It's just a lot of committing to the art for its full length of time. Yeah, as you say that, they just switch arts straight out. But, no. We don't see enough arts, in my opinion. We've seen a lot more plain show. No spice. It's an interesting option for sure, because you're not taking any time to commit to the um, to changing your art, but you really want to take advantage of those additional properties. Like right there, up B killing off of Smash Art. Although I feel like it's a little, I wouldn't say too little too late, but it's definitely on the uh, the back foot, giving a whole stock behind from Ruse. Yeah, and tries to go for the same combo again. I just don't think that combo works on fast followers. And Oh, you saw the counter just waiting for it. And you see a lot of shows switch to this shield during those moments when they're getting comboed. But Secret just opts not to. Yo, my man's just with the vision. I don't know what he's trying to counter, but he's going for it. Yeah, he, I believe he's, he's trying to foretell a, just a BP up B or side B past ledge. But Roos is opting to go to the ledge. Going on the offensive in this kind of a situation can be very bold, but I think he exhausted his jump in a really awkward spot. Ends up SDing because of it, and Bruce nabs away game one. I'm not going to lie, I'm not going to sugarcoat it. Bit of a mess for game one. I feel like there's a lot of opportunity for Shulk to deny airspace from Wolf, regardless of how good Wolf's nair and back air are for contesting space. Shulks are better. Shulk's Nair takes up a lot of space, isn't a particularly hard commitment, especially if being used within speed or buster art. Like, you can convert one stray hit into a lot of damage, or you can peel to safety. So, seeing some sort of adjustment in usage of the art and the aerial play, I think is going to be big for Secret to stay alive. Yeah, it definitely would, would be, because this is not winner side anymore. This is loser side. And to make top 32, or in, I believe we're in top 32, to make top 16. Yes, sir. And you, you need to find something. Pray to whatever god you you want to. Like, yo, I, 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 need, I need to, like, I need to figure them out. I feel like matchup-wise, things are looking fine. And we are sticking to uh, the Shulk against the Wolf. But I think it's just a different approach in play because we really didn't see Ruse do much of anything there. It's just sort of reacting to uh, a lot of the buttons that Secret was putting out. And then with Punishing Shulk has always been his uh, his Achilles heel. But with very little attempt on defense, I don't know. Yeah, I'm not sure if you hear the ice cream. Oh, no, yeah. But, man, low-key banger. Is it? it Loki. They only come around when I commentate, so... Oh, that's hype! <laughs> Always makes an appearance. Yo, Mr. Softy Player 4? No. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's right outside front of my house. The neighbors. <laughs> he's just gonna be here for a bit now. That's terrible. Alright. 
Nonetheless, Game 2 is bringing us a bit of a different change, and this one a bit more of a grim one for Secret. Ruse opting to switch to Palutena. Uh, very good matchup into uh, Shulk. You know, for the longest time regarded as one of Shulk's worst. This is a character that's able to play off of, regardless of whatever art is on the field, very well. Having an exceptional combo game on shield art, being able to chase down and properly intercept speed art, and able to turn any type of reversal during smash art. This is a character that we have to see Secret play very reserved with if he's going to look to stay alive in bracket. Yeah, and you said regarded once, once regarded as one of his worst. Still, it has not changed because not many characters can deal with Shulk in the progressive manner. But Palu just able to have some of the best aerials in the game. Is able to stuff off Shulk before he begins, because even though he has a long sword, it takes a while to start up. Excellent DI off that back air. Bit of a screwy situation, but Bruce staying alive with it. Okay, yeah, the F smash. Shulk classic. Alright. I feel like there's a hey man, I feel like there's a timer on Shulk F smash. What do you mean, like a kitchen timer? Like, like, they they will all throw it out eventually. You just gotta oh, figure yeah. out. You just gotta figure out when. It's a great tool. It has exceptional range, exceptional kill power, even outside of Smash Art. Uh, it shortens Shulk a little bit, so it's even valuable as a uh, reversal option just off the hurt box shifting. Yeah. And this this Palutena is looking like more like a secondary than us. Co-main. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, no, this has definitely got, like, pocket pally syndrome. A lot of the Nair is in neutral, not a lot of, uh, Fourier. Although, Ruse is at least aware of which tools to use to contest in what situations. It's just really bad calls here on these jumps that Secret's taking full advantage of. Got that down there, almost doing it. Oh, that's what I'm trying to say. That right there. Use those arts to escape those situations and just get yourself in, into a reset neutral. You might take a bit of damage, you might lose stage control, but you still have your stocks. And when you're down a game in loser's bracket, you need to do everything you can to stay alive. Yeah, and... Just keeping up the pressure. That's it. Yep. Hopefully you can't, can't do anything there. Oh, well, tried to get the show up with an area that doesn't go through. I love the quick switch to shield. Just don't give any opportunity for combo. Although, Roos is not looking to stay on that pressure. Yeah, I know. It's... I don't know if I've seen a single jab out of Roos. Oh, uh, jab? Not as good in this game as it was in previous iterations oh you're absolutely correct but when it comes to shulk it's a really good option just for stuffing his face but hey down air gets the job done just as well Ruse not letting go of that we're looking at a 2-0 count i like the adaptations from secret but it was definitely too little too late that game against wolf was way too rough for them yeah it was not that great and dies around yeah 56 that's rough, seven. buddy. Yeah, that early percent kill on the last stock. And that's the tournament life. Rue stays in and makes it out into the top 16 side of bracket.